seven days later, he's waiting for us up at his old club, Middlesbrough. Good morning and good luck, Keith O'Neill! Jim, Helen, how are you? Yeah. On June, I'll come to Riverside. I'm here and I'm back in the promised land. What a fantastic setup we've got today. A lot of people in the city looking forward to the game. I tell you what, there's a conspiracy going on there, Tim, Helen, I think. You've given me the wrong cables, the wrong earpiece. It's my first show. I tell you what, this is going to be hard work. Yeah, you're here right. Here we go. This is, where the, this is the first... This is where I used to sit. Here we are. We've got... Uh, Mendieta is filling my peg. How good is that? I don't know where. Uh, he'll do. He's not too bad. <laughs> We've gone now. Everything is sorted. <laughs> Alex the kit man is very thorough. As you can see, the massage beds, the injury beds. I've got an awful lot of bollockings in this room. An awful lot of bollockings. Everything was my fault. You, Keith, you can't, say that. Now. you can't say that word, Keith. You're not allowed to swear no. on television. No, I didn't swear, Tim. No, you know I me, Tim. Swear. I don't swear. I don't swear. Tim, I'm going to walk up here. <laughs> let's have a little look. What we got? I'm walking up. We've got, um, we've got the dope and control station. Let's have a look. Let's see who's in here. Laney! Yeah, Tim Helen. Laney is the face of Middlesbrough. Laney. Come on there, Laney. Laney. I'm going to kill you. Why? Laney, you're the face of Middlesbrough. The Reggie Cray of Middlesbrough there, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. We're just going to walk down the tunnel a little bit. We're going into the away dressing room. Let's have a little look in here. Here we got the away dressing room. Who have we got in here? Oh, big man. Tim Flowers, ladies and gentlemen. Tim, how are you? How do you think the game's going to go today, Tim? Who's Paul McAndrew there. Pa Paul McAndrew, ladies and gentlemen. Here, Tim Allen, what about the big man here? He's going to give us a result on today's game. Uh, result, not too sure. We need a win. We need a win, that's for sure. We're back in the bottom three, so we could do with the points. I think we'll nick it. 2-1, mate. Ooh, I'm going with Middlesbrough and myself. So I'm going to back Middlesbrough and myself today. Tim, fantastic talking shit. I'll see you in a bit. Thank you, lads. Now, we're walking down the tunnel. This is where the butterflies used to be in my stomach. I used to be walking down. You'd walk out this tunnel... And the riverside be going crazy, <laughs> clapping the hands. I can hear them. I walk down. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's so long since I've been back here. I'm getting the buzz already. Oh, my God. It's covered up, as you can see now. The, the hollow tomb for the riverside is covered up. Oh, my God. Tim, I tell you now, it's the first time I've been back here in two years, and I've got a butterflies. Butterflies. <laughs> Tim. Okay, give us a quick prediction. What do you think today? A quick prediction. I think Middlesbrough are going to win 2 0. And Tim, another thing. Could you just tell Eric Bristol was on the show last week? He owes me £50. Yes. So I had Bradford and a draw. He had Norwich at home. And I think you and Eric were giving me a bit of stick saying I didn't know me football. I had Bradford in the draw. 50 quid in the bank. There you go. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, Key. Keith, yes, Helen. I, I just don't know what to do with all these questions that I had to ask you. I think I'd better do that with them, yeah? Um, go, on, go on, for you, Helen. No, no, you did them all. You did them all in one breath. Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you ever so much. Keith O'Neill. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Tim. I, I enjoyed that, and I've just apologised for the swearing, even though he denies it. <laughs> <laughs> right.